and strangers Winking on my feet Then I see the moonlight Sparkling in your eyes Oh, my body's frozen And my soul's on fire Just follow me, baby Pulling at me with a foxy moon Gently come over My body's a boat Hello everybody, welcome to the Nail Tip Show. I'm Tiffany and today we're gonna to be doing another amazing nail look inspired with Halloween. And if you guys um, have been joining us before, you know that we have been doing multiple nail art demos to show you guys different nail art techniques and just having fun while we're showing you guys with our nail um, hand model and also our nail artist. Um, we just want to come back and share with you guys another look and this is your first time Thank you so much for joining us here today We're so excited to have you here and joining us for the first time and if you are new make sure to comment down below where you're watching from um, We do our show here on Tuesday and Thursday. So Tuesday typically we start at 1130 a.m PST time and then Thursday at 6 p.m. PST. So if you guys like this nail demo and nail art look, make sure to come back and join us on Thursday. Now this these nail art these nail art demos are also in Vietnamese and um, English, so we'll be teaching in both. So if you guys like and enjoy that, make sure you give us a little thumbs up or like our video. And 
Again, if you guys missed out on our previous videos, you guys can always go back and check out our old videos. They're always available for you to watch. We've done so many different nail looks from, you know, milk bath, we've done gel looks, we've done really cool crystal nail art, we've done luxury brands. So really anything that you're looking for, you most likely will find it on one of our videos. So just make sure to head back and check it out. Today, it's gonna be really exciting because we have another guest here in the studio with us and she's joining us as a hand model. So everyone say hi to Sierra. Hi, Sierra. <laughs> Um, if you guys um, are watching, make sure you give us a thumbs up and just show us some love and support for Sierra because she has graciously donated her hands to us as we do our nail look today with a more gothic and floral look. I have never personally seen a lot of these nails look and so I'm so excited for you guys to see it too. We're doing a combination of like really deep black and some blues and really combining that with the floral, um, paper florals, okay? All right, so without further ado, um, let's introduce our nail tech of the day. Well, really of always actually. <laughs> <laughs> and Jig. <laughs> Hello everyone, em mến chào các bạn đến với chương trình The Nail Tip Show Facebook Live và YouTube Live. Hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ với các bạn một cái kiểu uh, em nghĩ cũng rất là uh, mới lạ cho cái mùa thu này. Thì hôm nay em sẽ phối hợp uh, những cái bột và những cái design mà mình nghĩ là trái tim hoặc là những cái bông mình không có phù hợp cho mùa thu nhưng mà mình với cái cách màu mình phối hợp màu với những cái glitter thì em nghĩ rất, rất là phù hợp. Thì hôm nay em cũng uh, uh, muốn chia sẻ với các bạn một kiểu mẫu làm mà móng dài nhưng mà các bạn cũng có thể làm ngắn lại nếu mà có những khách hàng của các bạn không thích móng dài ok um, hello everyone hello beautiful friends i hope you are doing well um, today i'm kind of like uh, sierra she loves dark uh, colors so i this is why i want to invite her because i figure i'm going to do a nice dark tone kind of like acrylic nails and then it's kind of appropriate for fall and kind of like Halloween kind of like vibe right now so um, she's really liking that I'm incorporating like a deep red but almost like a gray tone but in it looked kind of like a deep red but it's almost like a black cherry red right yeah so it's really nice so yeah um, I have done two nails already so uh, these will be the look but I didn't totally finish it yet just so you can see that's the look we're going for Right, like a deep red, and I'm gonna give you all the products info soon. But look at that. Can you guys see that? Make sure you frame in the middle. Right? I feel like this is really gorgeous, it's easy, it's fun. Right? So it's kind of give you a like a dark vibe, but then you still give you that kind of like a Halloween vibe too, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely kind of like I feel like it's kind of gothic because it's like really dark and like gothic the looks mm -hmm. are always like black and like white mm -hmm. but having that little pop of color and little sparkle so i feel yeah. like this is this is a new halloween look i haven't seen before i'm i'm excited okay so yeah uh, hôm nay các bạn cũng thấy đó em đã phối hợp hai cái màu màu uh, giống như màu gray và màu đỏ màu, màu đen mà đỏ mà đỏ đen đó các bạn thì em đã phối hợp hai cái màu này sẽ làm cho các bạn một cái kiểu mẫu uh, tượng trưng cho mùa thu nhưng mà nếu mà các bạn có cách những khách hàng mà không có thích mặc uh, Halloween nail thì cái kiểu này cũng rất là phù hợp tại vì nó 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 có cái kiểu mà dark tone màu tối giống như màu Halloween nhưng mà nó không có kiểu mấy cái mấy cái ma rồi mấy cái uh, skull hay mấy cái uh, skeleton mấy cái kiểu Halloween ha thì anh nghĩ cái kiểu này thì nhiều người sẽ cũng thích thì bây giờ em sẽ cho các bạn biết là những sản phẩm em xài ha so em dùng những sản phẩm hôm nay là của Nitro nhưng mà em đã dùng một cái Nitro là một cái Joy Collection mới cho cái mùa holiday nhưng mà em nghĩ cái màu collection này cũng rất là phù hợp cho mùa thu và mùa đông thì hôm nay em sẽ dùng cái màu NJ8 và NJ7 và tất cả là với lại tất nhiên là mình không có cần um, tất cả là nhưng mình không có thể nào thiếu được cái clear luôn nha các bạn Tại vì lúc mà các bạn dùng những cái màu tối đậm thì mình nên dùng cái màu clear Nhất là mình dùng mấy cái uh, glitter hoặc là những cái uh, bông giống vậy thì mình encapsulate với clear nha So NJ7 and NJ8 
is the two colors I'm using from the new uh, newest collection from Nitro, which is their like a holiday collection. So these two, I feel like it's really uh, versatile where you could use it for fall and winter as well. And of course you can never um, live without crystal clear when you use, especially when you use with high pigmented colors. So today I'm using it with monomer. So let me just show you, this is the gray color. Đây là màu xám ha. Màu xám nhưng mà nó có tí giống like a, like a blue undertone. Nó có cái... Um, and then this is it's a, it's a gray but it's almost like a blue undertone ha. Huh? Yeah, like there's a, a little slate. bit of blue in it. Yeah. And this is like a deep red. Because lúc mà các bạn dùng mấy cái bột này with uh, liquid thì nó ra đậm hơn chút xíu. So yeah. And then let me open the clear. This is really a nice crystal clear, okay? So bây giờ em sẽ phối hợp nha. So bây giờ em sẽ, I'm gonna try to do something like this. And I'm gonna twist it up and make something different, okay? Yeah, All we right. have we have the Nitro Joy collection. I have a little swatch of it here. <laughs> and it's so pretty. So this is the Joy collection. It's um, kind of geared towards the holidays. So it's a combination of glitters and just really nice um tones like the your your reds and your deep purples um definitely something that you can you know really switch up and use for um the upcoming season so nitro joy collection has 12 colors and we're featuring that today um which is so exciting so if you guys are interested just head over to our website because it is available on our website today yeah okay so bây giờ em uh, trước khi bắt đầu thì em cũng muốn cho chia sẻ là em có dùng một cái bông của cái dry flower collection này ha uh, và em sẽ dùng cái chất uh, cái tim này nó là đen nhưng mà nó có cái ống ánh nó giống như là màu ống ánh với blue với silver that's why em, em nghĩ nó rất là phù hợp với là những cái màu mà em, em dùng và hôm nay em sẽ cũng dùng cái flex của cái uh, trong cái collection uh, mà em có trong The Nail Tip Shop ha So ba cái món này là những cái gì mà em xài lên trên ngón của model này ha So yeah, so these are the nail art products that I'm using is the flakes This is the flakes number 9 And this is just part of the mixed glitter that we have uh, It's like a deep uh, black but with, with the light you can see it has kind of like the blue and the gray undertone So I feel like it's, it's really um, blending well with these kind of colors that I'm using. So yeah, so then let me show you. Okay, so trước khi bắt đầu thì uh, em đã bỏ cái clear uh, bột trước trên ngón nha. Tại nếu mà các bạn không dùng clear thì những cái uh, bột màu này nó sẽ ăn lên móng của khách. Uh, thì lúc mình tháo ra rất là cực ha. So start off, I'm just using a clear just to have that as an undertone. Um, just like it adds strength and also save the nails when you do a lot of um, soak off or e file it off later. Okay, so start off, I'm gonna take this gray right here a little bit and just start with the cuticle area. Okay, and the sap the cuticle. So from cuticle, I'm trying to blend it down. I'm using this gray. And I'm just gonna do it in a way where I'm just gonna do it like a one third of the nail. And chỉ đắp lên khoảng chỉ một phần ba của cái móng thôi nha các bạn. I'm gonna do something different. So then, but at the end, it all gonna tie it in together. So bây giờ, I'm just trying to take my brush and just blend it out and keep it in the shape that I want. Okay, and then I'm gonna take my knife gonna dip in the brush and I'm just gonna cut it I don't want it that much and say cut not huh? oh we forgot to say hi to few friends you want to do that yep I can do that all right we are open I have uh, one open for Facebook one open for YouTube so if you guys have any questions want to say hi or comment down below make sure to do that so we can read it out loud and give you a shout out all right okay so I'm gonna read on YouTube so I see Tina Tina said hello hello Tina um, 
Prophetic Declaration Corner said, greetings, hello. Sharia said, hi, ladies. Lisa just gave me an alien emoji. Hey, girl, what's up? Uh, Anna said, hey, Tiff, hey, and Ann. Hi, Anna. We got Brianna also said, hi. Uh, Darkness Woman said, hi, and Tiffany, and hi, everybody. Um, Brianna commented, said, the nail looks really pretty. Um, thank you, you guys. Make sure you have any comments or questions down below. Just, just put it down there. We'll, we'll, we'll get to them. And then, On do you want to see her on Facebook? Um, I saw Clara. Hi, hi, Am. I saw, um, I have Anna. I have Lucy. Uh, Geneva. Uh, I don't, is it Sherry? And Christine. Hi, Christine Am. Hi, Am. How are you? Thank you for tuning in. Uh, And um, cũng khuyến khích uh, nhờ các bạn share cái live này dùng để những ai làm nail và cùng uh, chung vui với mình và từng tương tác và chia sẻ những cái nail technique nhé. Uh, em đang làm những cái kiểu mẫu của màu pho nhưng mà mấy cái màu này thì em nghĩ các bạn cũng sẽ rất là thích tại vì mùa thu thì nhiều khách hàng thích những cái màu đậm hơn và những cái kiểu mẫu này thì em nghĩ nó cũng phù hợp cho cái tháng Halloween tại vì mình không có cần uh, nhiều khách có không có thích Halloween nail thì đây là cũng một cách để mình dùng những cái màu đậm đậm để mình làm phối hợp với kiểu mẫu rất là đẹp ha so right now I'm just gonna wait for that little dry little bit and then I'm just gonna file that nail off to keep it more straight line Okay. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Queen, a uh, uh, username, Queen said, hey, <laughs> hey, um, Lori said, hi from Florida, you are so talented. Oh, thank you. We try to, we try to share as much as we can, just so, because I know uh, in my early years when I do nails, I have really hard time of come up with the designs and all that, so I feel like this way, you know. You can support us. I can also support you by sharing, give you some ideas and just some techniques that helps you your daily work in the salon. All right, guys. So now I'm just trying to clean up a little bit because I want to keep this area clear. Sometimes if you don't need it too clear, then it doesn't really matter much. But today I slightly want it more clear. So I'm just kind of bevel the surface out a little bit to keep it clean. So, thông thường nếu mà mình không có cần làm clear nail á, thì mình không có cần làm sạch cho lắm nhưng mà hôm nay em muốn nó clean nó sạch chút xíu so mình dùa bớt nó đi để cho nó thẳng và cho nó đẹp ha. So yeah. So now with this clear, I'm just gonna use all the glitters that I'm using here and the flakes as well. So I'm gonna continue it with the clear just a little bit, okay? Just a little bit. And dùng tí clear ha. Bỏ lên cái móng. So then, I'm just gonna take a little bit clear. Actually, just wet your brush and just place your heart. And this just kind of just play however you think it fits, you know. All right. And then I'm I love this rose right here. I feel like it's really perfect. Kind of something different, you know. And then I'm gonna add. Gonna add the extra heart in here. Yeah, cứ mình cứ làm từ từ ha. Mình uh, nếu mà các bạn không muốn đắp cho nó nhiều thì mình đắp ít từ từ cho nó lên. So I'm just gonna add a little bit powder and add the heart. Mình cứ lấy tí bột mình từ từ mình add nó lên nha. Đó. Tại mình làm không có dày nên mình cứ từ từ mình add nó lên thôi ha. I love those little heart glitters. They're so cute. They're like a little bit um like was it holographic almost? Yeah. So it looks really pretty. I like it. Mm -hmm. And the paper flowers. I kind of like the little detail. It has like a little bit of glitter on it. Mm -hmm. Um, and it's more of a cutout, which I really like. So you just layer it until you feel like okay, you're happy with it, and you stop. But if not, then you just kind of keep adding. So I'm just gonna add. I probably stop right there and then um, to amp the look a little bit I kind of add the flakes because I, I with this kind of um, with the flakes I love it because under the light anytime you look under the light it always gives you a nice reflection so what I'm gonna do is just adding that flakes in the negative space and that's it yeah I so love just it. wet your surface a little bit and just add that flakes because flakes is so thin too it's really great way to 
add depth to the nail but without adding too much powder so you keep the nail thin so cái flex này rất là mỏng so em chỉ lấy uh, cái cái nó cái cỏ bỏ tí nước nước ướt ướt ngay chỗ cái mặt á sau so, bắt đầu mình lấy cái uh, cái cỏ cái mình ịn nó lên cái cỏ mà ướt á thì cái 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 flex nó sẽ dính vô cái cỏ thì mình sẽ bỏ lên thì nó nó rất là nó ống ánh rất là đẹp một phần nữa mình làm cái flex này á nó hay cái là nó không có cần bỏ nhiều bột lên trên mặt móng thì nó không có làm dày cái mặt móng thì nó rất là đẹp với lại nhìn ở dưới đèn đó nó rất là sáng ha this is why I love this look to find that it's so pretty you know especially in the light if you know they go a club or night somewhere sitting the reflection of the, the flakes is really nice Yes. Sierra, do you typically like nails like these? Um, I do. I do like the more dramatic look. Yes. Mm. I know. Look at your hair. It's like so, yeah, cool. so, so I'm, beautiful. I'm not about being subtle. So <laughs> this is right up my alley. Yes. And the dark colors, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> so everything about this, I'm... I'm all about it. Yeah, do you typically like wearing like long nails? It's like, yes, like... I do like the long dramatic look. Okay. Mm -hmm. So do you have any tips for wearing long nails? Because I always, I am doing like, I'm typically the hand model and you know, she always does long nails on me, but I always have to cut it off because I like, literally can't do anything. So do you have any tips for <laughs> for wearing long um, nails? You know what? I'm still, I'm still learning myself. <laughs> um, the hardest thing, though, is definitely contacts, doing makeup. Oh. So finding the like the new technique to yeah. <laughs> apply everything and get ready and yep. putting on clothes. You got to be a little more careful. Yeah, so I'm just not as quick. Yes, yes, everything's so. slower. I always oh, say yeah. the hardest part is like going to the bathroom. Like yeah, going so. to the bathroom <laughs> with very long nails mm -hmm. is very difficult. Yeah, you gotta you gotta take your time. There's, <laughs> there's no rushing with uh, the long nails. Yeah. <laughs> I know I can't I, I've always like always wore short nails or wore natural nails even mm -hmm. though my mom does nails I always wore my like I just either cut it short or just just enough for me just to like get by right cut off for a couple weeks and then start over again but yeah I see Pauline she said hi Anne hi Pauline <laughs> so yeah right now I'm just encapsulating the the all the art that I have done. So now you want to protect that. So then you want to give it a clear uh, uh, layer just so then when you file everything, everything stay in place. And then, then you can see all your design with the clear, of course. All right. Yeah, Halloween is so close. I know. I can't believe it's already Halloween. <laughs> We're like in the last 90 days of 2020 oh baby we are we are slowly making it okay yeah. slowly making it so bây giờ em lấy cái bột ha uh, em make sure em bỏ mấy cái clear lên mặt mặt móng để cho mình protect cái cái những cái uh, cái design mình đã làm thì bây giờ em bỏ đó các bạn đó nếu mà các bạn coi em đắp em muốn giữ cái design nhưng mà mình cũng không muốn làm dày cho quá tại vì những cái design này làm mình làm uh, mình design mà mình làm dày quá tí mình dũa rất là cực so em vừa làm em vừa rất là cẩn thận try to mình làm từ từ thôi những các bạn mà mới vô nghề á mình đừng có cần phải hối phải gấp cứ làm từ từ để cho cái shape của mình nó ra chuẩn ha so bây giờ cái chỗ này á uh, I've just add a little bit more clear over there just to add my apex a little bit high and then that way you have enough powder, special for long nail, you know you need the apex slightly a little higher, okay? So then pretty much it. Yeah, Brianna comes and she said, I like to be on my laptop, but it's so hard typing with long nails. <laughs> yes, yep. right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like using your phone, like your little, like using mm -hmm. the thumbs, yeah. like text is like really hard. Oh, yeah. And um, I'm a receptionist at a hair salon, so when I like... <laughs> Have the phone, I have to like hit the side, yeah, do the, the side. knuckle. <laughs> yeah, or like mm. I grab something else, like a pen to like oh, yeah. tap it. Mm -hmm. It might be a little easier. Yeah. Um, Sharia said, I received my tips and I love them and I will be wearing long nails for the first time. Oh, Sharia, nice. I hope you enjoy them. Please, if you ever take any photos, tag us so we can see them. We'd love to hear or see like what it looks like you're going to be recreating any more designs we'd love to see it okay so now with this one um 
I'm just going to do, because I already like matching the cutout with this, so I'm not going to do the same thing. I'm just going to use one solid color on this one. So, but yeah, because I already put the clear, so now I'm just going to go straight with the color, okay, guys? And I bought the clear on the face of the face. So, now I'm going to bought the face. But for those of you, if you want to make a bold, hay là làm đậm tiếp biệt các nhớ nha lúc mà các bạn các bạn có dùng mấy cái màu đậm như vậy á lúc nào cũng phải dùng cái màu clear ở dưới để cho lót cái cái màu clear để cho cái màu nó 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 không có ăn da thịt của, à, móng thịt của khách hàng và lúc mà mình có tháo nó cũng đỡ cực nữa ha. is this is this um, this is from the joy collection is that correct yeah yeah this is the color we used um, if you guys had tuned in last Sunday, um, we did this really gorgeous um, nail look, kind of um, in preparation for the holiday season with another special guest we had, uh, Kizuin, on the show, and it was amazing. Um, if you guys didn't know, her, if you don't know who she is, she's a very well-known, like, basically a celebrity. Like, everyone in the Vietnamese community loves her. She's a, a well-known MC, and she MCs for the show called Paris by Night, and she was on the show, and we talked everything about the nitro nails and their new collection and this is the color that was used also um for my nails and we did a combination of that really deep um like maroon with in combination of like a neon yellow which mm -hmm. i know doesn't sound like it works but when you look at it it looks really really beautiful so if you guys are like not really into Halloween, but you're like really excited for the holiday season and really trying to like think about, you know, different ideas coming up. Well, you guys just need to stay tuned because we're going to be having a really uh, special event coming up next week um, on Monday. So if you guys are waiting to see holiday looks, mm -hmm. Halloween is come by really quickly and the, the holidays are creeping up on us too. Um, next Monday, we will be doing an amazing um, live demo in, in partnership with OPI and as well as two other suppliers, uh, one in Chicago and one um, here in Southern California, right in Anaheim. And we will be doing a live demo. We'll be showing you guys different holiday looks. Um, you guys have to join in. And won't be the nail tech she'll be hosting, but we'll have very special nail um, artist uh, to come in and show you guys a live demo. So that's happening next Monday, October 26th. And the first demo would be will be available at 8 a.m. PST time, and the next will be 10 a.m. PST time. So uh, for those, if you are in the Midwest, maybe you're from Chicago, um, that the first one would be at, I believe, 10 a.m. your time. Oh, 11. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So the first, yeah. So the first one will be at 10. The second one will be at 11. No. No. One at eight California time and one 11 o'clock. Oh, yes. California. We're getting this mixed up. So sorry. <laughs> so Lee Nail um, Supply is at eight in the morning. Eight in the morning. That's our time. Yeah. But what is it their time? That's 10 o'clock their time. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I was right. Yeah. 10 o'clock. Um, for those in the Midwest, 10 a.m. is the first one that you want to join, join in on. Uh, we'll be in partnership with um, Lee, Lee Nail Supply out in um, yeah, Chicago, I believe. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure to tune in. And there's, there's going to be another special giveaway, okay? I told you guys we'd be doing another giveaway. So go, come back, join us, and there'll be a giveaway. OPI will be, um, f we'll be featuring some of their products as well as um, some supplies from nail 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 lee lee nail <laughs> lee yeah. nail supply um, and nail max from uh, and then anaheim. nail max yes is the um, nail supplier in anaheim so if you guys want to find out more information make sure to head over to our instagram and our facebook um our new instagram account is at the nail tip show underscore and our facebook page if you're already on facebook make sure to um just turn on your notifications and if you're watching on youtube head over to our facebook page to make sure that you're you're liking the page so mm -hmm. yeah so i want to let you guys know about that and we're really excited um this is a really exciting project for us and uh we're just so excited thank you guys for your support every every single one of you who's watching 
uh, we really cannot do this without you. So um, make sure to just give us a like on this video and share if you can, just so that um, you can help grow our page. And we know that uh, you guys are enjoying these videos so that we can provide more nail art tutorials for you guys as well. Yeah. Uh, nếu, nếu mà các bạn đang coi chương trình uh, em với The Nail Tip Show có một cái uh, nail show thì các bạn cũng biết with COVID thì những cái công ty um, không có tiện lợi tới những cái supply để làm mấy cái nail show uh, cho những cái vùng của các bạn thì uh, OPI với The Nail Tip Show sẽ mang nail show tới các bạn vì các bạn chỉ cần ngồi ở nhà với cái phone hoặc là cái laptop hoặc là những cái tablet các bạn có thì các bạn có thể uh, lên cái... Uh, thứ hai tuần sau vào 8 giờ sáng giờ Cali à, hoặc à, 11 giờ à, cũng là giờ Cali à, có hai cái chương trình đó là cái nail show của à, từ 8 giờ thì cái à, OPI The Nail Tech Show và Lee Nail Supply ở Chicago có 1 giờ là của à, Nail Max ở Anaheim California thì những cái hai chương trình này thì uh, of course OPI và những cái uh, Lee Nail Supply và Nail Max sẽ mang những sản phẩm mới mới nhất của công ty OPI và cho những các bạn những cái uh, promotion nếu mà các bạn mua những sản phẩm mới và uh, mà collection mới thì có rất là nhiều quà và The Nail Tip Show với OPI với hai supply này sẽ cũng mang cho những cái giveaway nếu mà các bạn coi những chương trình này thì cái đó là hai chương trình vào ngày thứ hai 8 giờ giờ Cali và 11 giờ Cali nha các bạn nếu mà các bạn à, muốn th muốn biết thêm chi tiết thì các bạn có thể lên cái à, The Nail Tip Show cái post and để coi những cái giờ à, phù hợp cho những cái tiểu ban của các bạn nhé yeah, Thank you các bạn và đó bây giờ em cũng làm xong rồi thì bây giờ em sẽ dũa nhưng mà các bạn thấy không bây giờ cái cái kiểu mẫu này nhìn nó cũng rất là đẹp ha bây giờ để em đóng mấy cái uh, bột này để lúc mình dũa nó không có bay vô nha so if you guys uh, want to know more info about the uh, the virtual OPI virtual nail show of course always go back to our post and check out the flyers so then you have more ideas what uh, what's going on on that day as well yes yeah, so um we do have it on our instagram page i just put the link down in my cap comment section down below mm -hmm. so if you guys want to just hit that follow us and then see the posters and we will be so excited to have you guys join us because it's gonna be really exciting and i can't wait to see the nail looks live in person yeah so uh bây giờ em sẽ dũa lại sơ sơ nha so cái móng này em làm xong rồi thì bây giờ let me fire so then you can see as always i just can't wait to show you the, the result because i feel like this look gonna be really good after you put the clear on well any look i feel like it's always better with the clear on right Tiff? yes i like the like i kind of like it's almost like it's like a glass like you're kind of looking through it with a glass it looks really beautiful delicate and mm. it's not bulky it just makes it look really like very very classy you know mm -hmm. very high class luxury look <laughs> <laughs> yeah with uh sierra she loves long nail too so it's it's nice to have a model that you know kind of appreciate what you do and she's willing to wear it too Mm -hmm. yes. I rock it. <laughs> yes, you do. You probably do. I, on the hand, I am clumsy and I um, like bop my hand everywhere because I talk a lot like this. So I hit my hand. I always end up breaking a nail somehow. Short nails are just safer. You know, it's really right. about other people, you know. So, um, I'm willing to take that. the risk. Yeah, guys. <laughs> it's my sacrifice. Don't worry about it. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, but yeah, and say like it three in one bit. I'm just uh and say you so so high bên hông này ha. Cho nó tròn lại chút xíu thôi. Để thường thường mình làm thì mình đắp nó cũng cũng gần cái shape mình muốn nhưng mà em just muốn cho nó tròn lại chút xíu thì em sẽ lấy cái bit rồi em sẽ đưa cái bit gần sát cuticle và cắt. Với cái bit này á, cái đầu nó nó hơi tròn á, thì nó không có phạm vô da và nó rất là an toàn để cho mình đi sát với cuticle nha các bạn. Cái này gọi là 3 in 1 bit ha Mà em đang dùng cái uh, medium uh, grit ha So right now I'm just taking this 3 in 1 medium bit Just contour the side And just thinning out the free edge And just go tightly around the cuticle area And then I'm just trying to flush out the cuticle and clean it out 
Uh, Brianna asks, what is a good RPM for filing? Uh, right now, I'm, I'm using about, I would say, uh, 17,000 RPM, 17,000, 18,000 RPM. Anytime you do service work, you want at least using at least 15,000 RPM. So then you have a little bit more speed to work. Okay, so I'm just going to, just a little bit lightly. So if you look at this, on the cuticle area, you turn the skin and just kind of go lightly. With this bit, I, like I said, it's really nice is that it has a little round, rounded top. So then it allows you to go tight around the cuticle area. Okay, so now let me turn. Now, as you do in the side, the, I mean the center, you want to aim the bit, the center, and just go with one direction. And you see the bit the way I do it, then it gives you a nice angle to the nail, too. So then you're not cutting to your client cuticle. And when you work on this side, turn this side so you can you have your it's lined up with your eyesight so then the bit and the nail will just go perfectly together so you not go over the skin sometimes when you don't see it you don't you know you go too tight on the cuticle area so you always turn the, na the, the nail when you work especially with the cuticle area so there i'm going to double check so you have everything make sure it's contour and you don't want to take all the apex that you have built you don't want to take it all down so right now i'm just going lightly over the surface just so then everything is just kind of like bevel and contour okay all right so now i'm just gonna straighten the line the side line with the hand file just one more time before I buff. Mm -hmm. So Sierra, are you a big fan of Halloween? Of course I am. <laughs> I'm very much looking forward to it. Um, I don't have a costume yet. I don't know what I'm gonna do. And it's, it's weird because I, I mean, with COVID and everything, like I'm, we're limited on what we're doing, but I, I feel like I have to. I know, I feel like everyone this year, I, we, our family, we don't typically, like, we only dress up because you have so many like kiddos, so it's like right. fun. But like, typically we don't. Um, but I'm actually really interested to see, like for those who are really excited about Halloween, which right. my sister is, she loves Halloween. Mm -hmm. She dressed up as um, Coraline and uh, Vanellope Von Schweetz, that's on yeah, from Shrek. From, I mean, I know. From uh, uh, Wreck-It Ralph. Wreck-It Ralph, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. She loves that one. She loves that one, yeah. So I'm really interested to see, like, the, for those who, like, are really into Halloween, because everyone, some people, it's, like, their thing. Like, they love right. it. They go all out. They get the costume. They look costumes. forward to it. Like, yes. For the whole year, yeah. Yes. I wonder a lot of people dressing up this year. I yeah, don't know. Mm. It's, it's weird. Yeah, what, what, are you, what is your best costume you've done previously? <laughs> well... Probably my favorite was Guy Fieri. That, no. That yeah, I did Guy Fieri. So it was I wasn't like a like anything cute. Yeah, I wasn't yeah, like yeah. a sexy like <laughs> pop. But yeah, I went Guy Fieri, and that was my favorite costume. Yes, for that sure. sounds so fun. Yeah, like, and I was comfortable, so it was it was great. Yes, because what does he wear? It's just like a but like a yeah, like the, the bowling like button down shirts with like basketball shorts yes. and flip flops. Flip flops and those um and the sunglasses. Like the old, yeah, the yeah. dad glasses. Yeah, sunglasses. on the back of the head, and then <laughs> the signature um the beard, the platinum spike. Yes. Hair, yeah. <laughs> So I went all out. It, it looked pretty cool. Nice, nice. I, <laughs> yeah, but, uh, I could totally see you doing something like, um, what is her name from Nightmare Before Christmas? Jack Skellington's. Oh, Sally. Sally. Yeah. I, mean, I already the have hair. the hair. Exactly. So. Yeah, you could totally do it. You can pull that off. Yeah. You could just put on the makeup. You could right? totally pull it I could. Off. That's so cool. <laughs> I've always wanted to like. When I was a kid, my, my the costume I loved, like I was in kindergarten, I was like a fairy. I was like, oh my god, I was just a princess. That's me. I never want to dress anything like scary. Really? Yeah. Princess is like the way to go. Wore like a, yeah, I think it's like a Barbie. Oh, <laughs> a Barbie, yeah. Like princess. Mm -hmm. I was uh, I was Sailor Moon three years in a row when I was a little kid. That's I love so fun. Sailor Moon. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a good costume. Yeah. Oh, That's she has three, like long yeah. hair too. Yeah. yeah. That was my thing when I was a little kid. <laughs> 
And then, yeah, now I'm guess some guy Fieri. I, guess don't, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Somewhere along the line. You're like evolution. Right. Like, I've, I've evolved now. It's fine. Right. <laughs> That's so cool. I don't think my mom has ever dressed up. No, we did, but not, I don't, I, to be honest, I don't. It's not my thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now um, let me just kind of, now that I've kind of beveled down the line, so I'm just kind of thin out the free edge because, you know, as you're filing it, it kind of gets thicker at the free edge. I'm just going to bevel it down a little bit. And I'm just going to make sure this cuticle is nice and flush. It's just kind of one last one. I always contour my cuticle with the e-file bit because I find that it allows you to go tight around the cuticle area. It's just more efficient for me versus doing the hand filing. Yeah, uh, Wynn asks, can you show us the best way to file coffin-shaped nails, please? Oh, okay. Coffin, okay, this is perfect. Right now, okay, các bạn làm thì các bạn phải có cái tay nha. Um, bố cái ngón tay này ha. Thì em lúc nào cũng lấy cái, um, coi cái, 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 cái chiều ngang á. Mình phải gần với nhau. Hai cái ngón này nó nhỏ hơn thì mình có thể bầu vô chút xíu nhỉ nhỏ hơn chút xíu nhưng mà hai cái ngón này at least nó phải gần ngang ngang với nhau thì các bạn thấy không cái chiều ngang của cái ngón này nó phải đều với nhau cái coffin đó mình tùy theo người có người thì thích nó hop vô nhiều có nhiều không thì mình phải khỏi cắt nếu mà cắt không thích hop vô nhiều quá thì mình làm nó gần giống như square cũng được mà square nhưng mà nó ôm vô chút xíu thôi còn cái này thì mình end bóp vô sâu thêm chút xíu nhưng mà cái này cũng là tùy theo cái cái cái, cái cái ý của những khách hàng mình thì mình lúc mình làm mình phải coi nhưng mà từ cái 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 line á muốn cho nó thẳng là phải từ từ cái góc này trở đi đi ra thẳng là giống như từ cái này nè góc này ha nó thẳng nó thẳng nhưng mà nó méo ra xuống thì hai bên này mình đều làm như vậy thì nó mình sẽ nó thẳng mà thứ nhất là các bạn cắt cái cầm cái me cái 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 dũa nè lúc mà các bạn dũa bên này á cái tay bên này mình phải in ra vô bên này ok rồi so mình làm vậy á cái line của mình nó sẽ ra thẳng Ok, còn lúc mà em dũa bên này thì cái tay bên này mình phải giữ cho nó thẳng hay là hoặc là cái này Làm như vậy đó các bạn thấy không? Cái cái dũa nó sẽ giữ thẳng thì cái line nó mới thẳng được Còn các bạn mà cứ để nó mà cứ dũa dũa nó, nó rung Mình không có ấn nó lại á, thì nó sẽ rung thì cái line Lúc cái, cái đường thẳng nó không có ra thẳng Tại vì nó không có cái đồ đệm lại để cho nó giữ thẳng lại So be sure là mình lúc nào cũng phải dũa, mình phải đệm nó lại nếu mà bên này thì em dùng cái bên này còn bên này thì em dùng cái tâm ha thì mình làm ngón nào cũng làm như vậy hết lúc nào cũng từ cái cuticle nè hai bên hông nè thẳng nó ra ha còn chỗ này cái mình bầu nó lại thì thì nó ra cái móng lúc nào cũng ra đều và bầu và đẹp hết đó các bạn uh, thử đi tại nếu mà mình dũ á mà mình không có đẹp nó thì cái 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 móng nó không có ra thẳng là thấy không? lúc mà em dũ lúc nào cũng em cũng đẹp hai cái bên ngược cái bên đó để cho cái cái nó thẳng lại Okay, so yeah, she was asking if uh, how to get a straight line when you shape coffin. So the first biggest pro tip that I can give you is always hold tight on the other side when you file on one side. Make sure you have a thumb on this one while you're filing this one. But if you're filing on this side, always have finger hold against it so then it's nice and steady. That way your line is not wobbly so then um, that's how it gets... Um, uneven when you file so i hope that helps guys try that yeah. especially when you work on a long nail the techniques you know it's slightly a little different okay. yeah uh china said hi hi china how are you hi china and then kiba also said hello hello kiba and i want to also say hi to nayeli said finally i can watch i keep missing your lives and yelly thank you so much for tuning in if you ever miss out on any of our videos you can definitely go back and rewatch it on both facebook and on youtube for so for those who are watching on facebook if you haven't done so already make sure to head over to our youtube channel and subscribe for those watching on youtube make sure to head over to our facebook page and like our page so that when we do have any of these amazing giveaways and events coming up in the near future um you guys won't miss out because uh we'll probably be doing most of the lives on facebook all right so those on youtube if you haven't done so already head over to our facebook page it's just at the nail tip show you definitely will find us <laughs> we have 
a good amount of followers and likers on there. So thank you again for you guys who have supported us by liking and sharing our page. We appreciate you so much. But if you haven't done so already, our Instagram page is new because we actually got it taken down, unfortunately. Uh, we still have no idea why. Um, I just would love to just give cautionary as leave this as a cautionary tip for those who are you know posting their nail art videos make sure to just um be careful what you're posting because we actually have no idea why our post got taken down but i've also been hearing this is a very common thing especially for nail art accounts so just be careful what you're posting we definitely want to keep sharing knowledge and our inspiration art looks out there. But um, yeah, if you guys would love to support us, make sure you head over to our Instagram page. It's just at the nail tip show underscore. Mm -hmm. Now I'm just taking my uh, sanding band and just buff everything. This is another way of buffing the nail really well. And I feel like with the sanding band, it really helps you contour the nail as well. This is why I love this technique. So if you guys haven't tried it, I recommend you guys try it. You will find the shape is, uh, I feel like it's better than hand fine, like buffing, I think. I mean, don't get me wrong, you you always need a buffer, but I feel like in general, in a salon, you are prepped with the sanding band. It's always a lot easier to prep, uh, to buff with this and then just discard the sanding band altogether. Then it's just quick and convenient. Yeah. Bây giờ em buff nó nha, em cho nó cho nó mịn lại và cũng một cách là mình làm cho cái cái mặt móng á, thứ nhất là cho nó bầu lại. Tại với lại cái 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 sen bên bên này á, mình làm á các bạn thấy không? Em đi á cho nó bầu cái móng nè, mình kéo nó xuống. Mình kéo nó xuống hai bên hông này, cho nó bầu lại cái móng. Thì lúc nào cái móng nó cũng bầu á. Đó. Mình mình đi nhất là những ai mà tay nghề chưa có quen với lại y phao á, với cái đầu dũa thì Yeah. And then đi với cái 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 mình um, buff với cái này thì cái shape rất là đẹp hơn. Đó các bạn thấy không? Em shape hai bên hông rồi cho nó thon lại. Cái bên này cũng cho nó thon lại. Mình từ từ mình dũa. Take time dũa cái móng tại vì cái 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 shape á nó ra đẹp và không cái móng cái bộ mình làm đẹp và không là cũng tùy theo cái cách mình dũa cái shape móng ha. Thì that's why em rất là kỹ lúc mà mình em dũa mình dũa bằng y pha thì nó đỡ cực cho cái tay mình nhưng mà mình cũng muốn cho cái shape nó đẹp và bầu và tròn và nhớ làm coffin shape nha các bạn các bạn phải cho mấy cái uh, dưới cái ngón nó nó phải chuẩn và đều hết nha Đó, em, em thích lấy cái này là em bầu nó lại cho nó thon lại hai cái bên hông này. nhất là ai mà làm mà cái bóng nó bè đó lấy cái này mình cứ giữ hai bên hông này cho cái cho nó 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 thon lại Yeah. Okay, so let me double check. Make sure all the side view, every view is good. I love the side view the most, so that's where make sure your shape. If you if, if it doesn't look good, you see the on the side view right away. It's really prominent. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. Look at that. Looks pretty good, right? Okay, so now I just see I have a little fuss on the top bottom. I'm just gonna clean that out. Make sure everything is nice and straight. That's how you get the straight line look. I'm excited to see this look. Mm -hmm. I feel like we always do like bright colors. I feel like this is the first like all like almost black and dark color like themed nails we're doing. So mm -hmm. I'm really excited to see this. Um, I typically don't wear black nails, but I feel like, I don't know, I kind of might be bold enough this season to do it. Like, why not? <laughs> I think mean, you should go for it, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's just like, it just matches everything. Like, you know? It like, does. It just, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Especially you have really long, beautiful red hair. I feel like you're like, bam, bam. Like, mm -hmm. I'm here for it. <laughs> <laughs> right. So bây giờ let me clean it up cho cho các bạn thấy nè nha. Cho cái móng nó đẹp nè. Look at the back looks good too. It's 
so cool. So cool, right? Love that. I know. Yeah. Our favorite moment is like coming up where <laughs> we finally get to put on top coat, we got to dry it, add some things, add some gems and beautiful things. So uh -huh. we are almost there to see the final look. All right, you get ready. Let me let me put the final top coat. I'm just gonna use the natural top coat. Okay, and I'm just gonna. Yay! Oh my gosh, love it. Uh, okay, so this is more like a deep red with the when you can see it's that. Pretty. Yeah. Love Let me it. Do. Okay. You guys see that? Put on top coat. I'm gonna put some design on this nail later, but I wanna show you guys this. This one. Nayeli asked, are you going to add gems? Nayeli, of course we're going to add gems. Mm -hmm. We cannot do a show here without gems, without crystals, without some flair to the look. So, yes, stay tuned. We're definitely going to be adding that. I really love that, um, oh, look that, that. color from Oof. Nitro. You guys see so that? Pretty. Yes. I love you guys the, see that? the glitter. This I is why I love. Else. Look how pretty that is, guys. Wow. Oof. I love it. I'm in love. And I love mm. the, that really deep red too because I feel like it's not really obviously that like red, but it's like very deep, almost like plum like color. But yeah. I really love it because the details, when you look up closer to it, you notice that it's more of a red rather than a blue or a black. So definitely really versatile, definitely an easy way to incorporate that into your Halloween so look, look or your next this two nails right Christmas guys. look. See, one is cut out and one is more like an ombre effect, but just as good, right, guys? Yeah, so if you guys like this look, make sure to give us a thumbs up or like this video uh -huh. so that we know that you guys are enjoying this. And I'm this excited. is just a color deep red. Because deep red. I try to stay away with black. I feel like I know a lot of people use black, but anyways, you could use a lot of deep color and just incorporate with the tone. I feel like the deep red and this gray really go nicely together, right? Mm -hmm. Look, ooh, so beautiful, Pretty. right guys? Okay, so now I'm gonna have her go in the light for, um, uh, okay, go. There you go, just for one minute. So, yeah, các bạn thấy thích không? Uh, let me know thì bây, uh, với cái, cái kiểu mẫu này thì anh uh, nếu mà thí dụ những người nào mà không thích màu đen á thì mình có thể dùng màu uh, đen giống như đỏ nè uh, màu xanh nè màu gray giống như vậy mình instead of mình dùng cái màu đen tại vì em biết màu đen có nhiều người thích có nhiều người không thì mình phối hợp mấy cái màu mà đậm chút xíu thì nó cũng ra một kiểu mẫu rất là đẹp thì uh, em mong các bạn uh, uh, thích cái mẫu hôm nay ha uh, Ashley says beautiful China said gorgeous. Sheree? Sheree? Yeah. Sheree? Mm -hmm. I, I don't know how. I hope I said your name right. Uh, she said so beautiful. Thank you guys. Thank you everyone. Yeah, I just, I, like I said, I just want to give you guys something because I know uh, I share a couple, you know, Halloween look, but I feel like just in case you can have clients that they don't really like, like Halloween themed nails, then this is another way kind of dress it up without using all the go skeleton, you know, all this uh, graveyard and all that look. But yeah, how's nice, right guys? You can like this. I feel like the heart and the flower goes really well together too. Oh my gosh, so uncommon. I am getting Morticia Adams vibes with these nails. Love it. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Scary, you could totally dress up as her too. Okay, I could. Just, I have options. Yeah, you do mm. have options. These nails definitely like add that little flair to it. They that do. Definitely uh -huh. can complete the look. All right, Definitely. guys. Uh, yeah, uh, em cũng mong uh, những cái gì anh chia sẻ thì các bạn có thể dùng những cái tip mà em đã chia sẻ với các bạn để phối hợp những cái gì các bạn uh, có trong salon. Uh, giống như về shaping thì uh, các bạn uh, cố gắng tập làm và những cái uh, uh, tip này em biết các bạn sẽ làm một bộ mẫu rất là đẹp. Cảm ơn các bạn rất nhiều và cũng uh, đừng quên vô cái trang mạng của cái uh, The Nail Tip Shop để mua những sản phẩm để các bạn có thể làm những kiểu mẫu đẹp nhé. Cảm ơn các bạn rất nhiều. Alright.
All right, you guys, we're going to be closing out the thing, but we're going to be adding gems. So if you want to see the final completed look, head over to our Instagram page, and you'll definitely see it when we post it right after this live. And um, just to make that an another announcement, because we're so excited about it, Monday, uh, October 26th, we'll be doing two live demos here in partnership with OPI and Lee Nail Supply and Nail, Ma Nail Max Beauty Supply, which is uh, Lee Nail Supply is a supplier in um, Chicago, and Nail Max uh, Beauty Supply is a, a supplier here in Anaheim in Southern California. So um, OPI is doing a virtual uh, pro show uh, just to showcase their new upcoming nail collection. And we're super excited to have them here in the studio. And we're gonna be having different nail art demos and we're gonna be having a giveaway. So if you guys are interested in that, definitely tune in, put a reminder, make sure to put your notifications on because Monday we are coming for you, okay? Make sure to um, join us back here on Thursday at 6 p.m. We're gonna be doing another nail art look as always. If you guys ever have any suggestions, make sure to head over to our, make sure to comment down below. And if you're interested in any of the products that we used today, whether it was the Nitro Joy collection or the glitters or the glitter flakes, um, uh, it did, Definitely head over to our website at thenailtipshop.com and you can get your Halloween stickers, holiday collections, and anything you need for nail art, we definitely probably have on our website. All right, you guys, thank you so much again for tuning in. We appreciate your support and we'll see you on Thursday. Bye. I met you, come on. <laughs>
We had this idea that we'd be exactly who we wanted to be that day. We would play our own games and make our own rules. We would give into desire and live our lives on the edge. We would play with fire, dance in the rain, And the next day, we'd do it all over again. Nitro Nails, made in America. We had the...